Good morning, folks. It's September 14, 2024. I'm up here on the upper end of Truman Lake again. Do a little crappie fishing this morning. It's about 7.20 in the morning. It's a little foggy when I first got started. It's overcast, uh, a lot of mist in the air. It almost like it's raining. I hope it don't get on my camera, but uh, I'm gonna see if I can put a few crappie in the boat. Don't have very long to fish. I'm only gonna fish till about 11 o'clock. I gotta quit and get home so I can watch my Missouri Tigers play football today. Uh, but it's a beautiful morning so far, a little light breeze. The uh, wind's supposed to get up to five to 10. I'm gonna see if we can catch a few crappie. Stay with me. All right, folks, I'm gonna start out with just a little 1 8 ounce hair jig white and silver and I painted the feathers it was white I, I used some uh, marker pen and uh, marked them yellow my good buddy Craig Hansen was out here yesterday he said that uh, that seemed to be a color that uh, they'd eat a little bit he also said you had to put it on them there's kind of a tough bite I'm going to try to pitch to them a little bit at first I'll probably be putting this down pretty quick and getting the long pole out uh, but We'll give it a try and see what happens. Uh, too many stumps. Man, I keep getting hung up in the stumps. I'm going to get the long pole out. They don't seem to want to chase after it. I have to put some old nibbles on too. All right, I get the old 14 foot B&M blue diamond out. I got the same jig painted the same way. This is a quarter ounce though. So I'm gonna see if they'll hit a bigger jig. Bigger the better. As far as getting it down there and getting on them. Let's see how finicky they are. Fish right there. Come on. Oh, he, oh gosh, dang it. He finally drilled it. That gummit. All right. He finally hit it. Tell you what, let's get some. Let's get some little nibbles out. Why not? Oh, I keep messing with them. Well, he took a swat at the old quarter ounce. Let us see. Come on. There you go, he hit it. Oh man, that's a nice fish there. I mean, a real nice fish. Wow. That's a nice way to start, absolutely. Boy. He hit the old quarter ounce jig. Nice. Let's see what that fish weighs. Yeah, 116. I'm not going to keep it. I just don't want to keep any fish. I'm thinking about keeping some today, but I'm just don't, I don't like to keep them over a pound. The smaller fish are better eating anyway, I think. And I just, I don't know. It's just a personal choice. I just don't like to keep the bigger ones. Not that that's a great big fish, but it's a nice one tell you what that works so I'll just put another nibble on I don't know if it makes any difference or not but don't fix it if it ain't broke I tell you bad as I didn't want to I brought some minnows I learned my lesson the last time I was out 
that gummit. That's a pretty good fish. There's looks like a pretty decent fish there too. A couple of them. Ah, come on. Gotta be right there. Yeah. Come on. Yeah, he looked at it and hit it. Gosh dang, another one like that. Man, I may not be able to keep any fish today. Wow, these are good fish. Very nice fish. Did the old quarter ounce jig. Well, let's see what it weighs. I may have to cheat on my standards a little bit. Yeah, 119. 119. <laughs> All right, buddy, you're gonna get to go back. That's good. Fun to catch. Okay, I don't care if I don't get to keep any. If I can just keep catching them, that sure is fun. They're eating it. They're eating the old quarter ounce jig. Let's put another nibble on. They're not just jumping on it, but they are hitting it a little bit. I want to start looking for smaller fish. If I want to keep any. Thread it on. Just because that's the way I like to fish it. Alright, now, where were we? There he got it. Oh, I don't think that's a crappie. Oh, it is. I got him in the side. Look at there. <laughs> wow. Gosh dang it. He came and swatted at it. Another good one. Look how I got that fish, folks. Right in the side. He got it. Oh, dropped right down on him. Good gosh, these are good fish. Come here, come here. Uh oh, he came off. Oh, how'd that break that off? That line broke off him. He hit the old minnow. One fourteen. I tell you, am I ever going to catch a fish I can keep? I'm going to go hungry. One fourteen. Gosh, dog. Boy, it's fun, but kind of killing my plans here. I don't know what happened there. My knot broke. Wasn't a very good knot. I'm using K9 10 pound braid. I love this line. It's white in color. I can see it. It's strong if you tie a proper knot. 
sensitive. I love K9 line, all kinds. If K9 makes it in what I'm wanting, that's the brand I use. All right. Got the old tag in off. Get us a minnow. What a beautiful day. I mean, it's gorgeous. Overcast, but I mean, the temperature is great. The wind is slight. Just shredding that right on, coming right out the back. All right. See if we can catch a keeper. An eater. All right, let's see. I'll tell you, a lot of fish in here, folks. I haven't gone hardly anywhere. There's one right there. In there. That fish looks like it'd be a eater fish if I could catch it. Or he won't catch it. I think that one right there is not a crappie, but I would be all right to be surprised. That fish that I was fishing for now looks bigger than what I initially thought. Let's just catch it. We'll find out. Where's my jig? Okay. Got it coming in a little bit. You got to get on them if you're going to catch them. You're looking at it. Oh, he took off. Come on. Don't be afraid. It's your meal. It's your meal. You're looking at it. I'm going to pull it up a little bit at a time. Oh, gosh, dang it. I enticed him. Look, he went right back down there. They're finicky. He wouldn't have anything to do with it until I started picking it up real slow and he followed it up and then just ate it, but he didn't get my hook. That's not fair. That's that right. That right there. Right here under the boat. Oh, it's a crappie. That's what that is. <laughs> uh, that's what I thought. Hey, we may be able to put this one on the stringer. Yes, I'm not even going to weigh it for fear it won't make it. No, that's a, that's a good keeper. down there toward the bottom. He'll be a keeper. Yeah. All right. That looks like a fish on top of that stake bed to me. Right there. Yeah, yeah, I was right too. <laughs> 
Yes, indeed. That's another nice fish. Another one. Do I weigh it? <laughs> I'm afraid to, because I'm afraid I'm going to be over a pound. Oh, 110. Sure as a whirl. Man, I can't keep any fish. Well, these are nice fish. Nice fish. The mud on him. I got my poles in the water. We're in 7.8 feet of water. That's the stake bed right there. I thought that was a fish up on top of it. Just had to keep working it. There's a fish on that lamb right there. Laying right on it. If I can get on it. There it is. See it at 14 feet. Right there. Oh, I just can't quite get it highlighted. It's right there. Oh, got his attention. God dang it. He nipped it. I bet he got momentum. Nope. He made a dash at it. I think he's still there. Not sure it's a crappie. I keep catching that lamb when I go by it. There he got it. There he got it. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Guess what? Oh, guess what? Another one we can't keep. Oh, what a nice fish. That's a dandy, folks. That's a dandy. I'll tell you what. I, I've royally screwed up this morning. Well, I haven't screwed it up. I came out here to catch some fish to keep, and all I can catch are fish over a pound, and I don't keep fish over a pound. So I've been throwing them all back. I've got about three or four on the stringer. I'm going to turn them loose because i got to go. i got to go watch the Missouri Tigers today. I love those tigers. That's a nice fish. Let's see what it weighs. I messed around and I started updating one of my electronics, and that cost me 40 minutes this morning. I didn't realize it was going to take that long, and frankly, I hit the update button by accident. Oh, that's a 141 right there. Really good one. Yeah, 141. That's a good way to stop. Or a good one to quit on. I got to go to the house, get ready, cook some wings. Yes, sir. Nice. At any rate, it's been a fun morning. I hadn't had a lot of time, but we caught some fish, and they were good ones. So, at any rate, I wasted part of the morning on my update, but that's okay. It's a nice morning to sit out here and update my electronics. So I'm going to go to the house, watch the football game. Thank you guys for being with me. If you like the video, I hope you like, subscribe, hit the uh, notification bell, and see which way would it be, this way? I think it'd be this way. There'll be two more videos pop up there. I challenge you to click on one of them. If you like this one, I think you'll like those. Thanks for being with me.